Hello, welcome back to my channel. In this, in today's video, we'll be talking about a common error message that you will be seeing uh, when launching Campstation. Believe me or not, you will be seeing this error message at least once in your lifetime uh, when uh, as a user of Campstation or can overlap Campstation. Okay, before we get started, please have me subscribe to my channel and hit the bell so that you don't miss any new videos I'm going to put out. Okay, so let's get into this uh, error message. Okay, so let me start with the uh, uh, open lab control panel over here. And uh, if I'm going to launch the software, and sometimes you will be seeing this message coming up. Okay, so, uh, so it will depend on slightly on uh, which version you are using and the message may be a little bit different, but basically they will be the same. Uh, for the version I'm using is C0110 uh, over here, which is the latest version. The message is quite clear over here and it actually telling you what to do. So let's go through that one. It, what, what happens here is uh, the software is trying to look for the method called default gc.m and for some reason this method is not available or not present in, in this uh, uh, method uh, folder. Okay, there's a couple of reasons why this could happen. Uh, very common is uh, this default EC is something that we are not using, right? So, uh, so most of the labs they actually uh, either archive this method, move this to an old folder, or even delete it away, right? So those are three uh, very common scenarios that this method is not uh, available, it's missing, right? So uh, the message actually tells you what to do. Is you simply need to copy back this uh, default GC method in this link over here, provided over here. And once you do that, you should be good to go. So let me show you that. Okay, let hit OK to close this. And then, OK, one more time here. Okay, so let's go into this PC, go to C drive. And that will be uh, under program files 86. And then Agile Technologies. And then Camstation, and then Data Archive, and then GC or LC, depending on which one you are working with. Then you go to GC and the methods, and then you just need to copy this the DF underscore GC dot M over here. Right, click copy it, and then you just need to simply move this method over to your master and method folder. So that will be under. Uh, C again, it depends on which version you are using, and if it's a new version like the one I'm using, that will be C uh, uh, users and then public and then uh, public documents, Camstation, and then uh, depending on which instrument you are working with, my one is number two. And I'm going here, go to methods, and, and as you can see, there's no default GC method over here. So that's why the GC, the software was trying to, uh, was not able to launch it. So I'm going to paste the uh, um, default GC method here, and then uh, I should, I should be good to launch my software right now. Let me show you that. Okay, it will take a few seconds. All right, so no error methods, so that should be good. Okay, there you go. So it's, you see that, let me maximize the window. Okay, you see that the software will be able to launch the software normally and we look for this method, right? It will load this method out to the EC for you, right? So that's a way how you fix that error uh, if you are using a new version like the one I'm, I'm, I'm using right now. But uh, uh, many cases you'll be using the older versions and uh, the error message will be a little bit different. Let me show you another one. Okay, let me zoom in a little bit. Okay, this is a very common error message that we've seen. It's basically the same one as the one just now, but the message will say a little bit different over here. It will say, uh, you see the version I'm, uh, I'm showing right now is C0105, and it will say the method file dollar key in section pcs one of Campaign i9 is not uh, is not valid or does not exit, right? So I see the same meaning that the method over here, the point here is it doesn't say which method, right? 
so that's a uh, that's a one point that uh, that's why the new version is a little bit better in that sense right so it's saying this method over here in this uh, file in this section of this file is missing right so uh, there's there's a few way you can do that is you can rectify this uh, uh, error message is if you uh, if you know which method the software is looking for and if you know that where that method is you know where the method has been archived or moved to you simply just need to copy that method back right to the to the method folder then you should be good but most of the time you don't really know because i mean in the lab may have multiple users i know you know like even the it department they sometimes they may do like like the backup of the pc and things like that and actually some of this method may disappear right so you don't even know which one uh, the software is looking for so uh, in order to give you a more generic ways to fix the problem i'm going to show you uh, this way okay first of all you need to look for the file from game session dot ini over here and that will be under uh, you go to c drive again and you go to program data and for uh, depending on which uh, window version you are using the program data may be uh, hidden uh, maybe hidden like this and you need to go to view and check the hidden items box over here to be able to see it then you go to program data and then you go to agile technologies then you go chem station then you will see the chem station dot ini right here then right click on it and then open by notepad okay uh, open with notepad over here okay and then uh, you scroll down and you'll be seeing it let me maximize the window okay you scroll down and then you will see over here there you go this is the pcs one that uh, in the message just now you will see so it's kind of like uh, it will depend on which instrument you are trying to launch it could be instrument number one instrument number two instrument number three number four blah blah so this one will tell you which instrument all right so that's mean you need to look for the correct pcs one two three four over here. in this case it's saying one so you just need to look for one over here where it is saying pcs2 then you need to scroll down and look for pcs2 right or pcs3 or anything like that it will be down here right so let's go back to pcs1 okay okay so this is uh, uh pcs1 and then let me show you the message okay it's saying method file dollar key is missing right so you just need to look for that one and that's right under this one right method file right here okay and the method that the software is trying to look for is in my case is d6417.m and if this method is missing from the method folder the software will show you that message just now so again the reason it could uh, that this method could have been moved could have been uh, archived could have been deleted right so what you need to do is you need to just need to go back to uh, your master folder uh, your your folder uh, your method folder okay and if you are using that old version it should be c then you should be say be able to see cam 32 or something like this over here because i'm not using that old version anymore so that's why you don't see over here but you should see c then cam 32 and then we be one two three four or depending on which instrument you're working with then you should be able to see your uh, method folder there right and once you see their method folder what you have to do is uh, so let me show you let assume that you have uh, the method folder look like this uh, let me go back to the one that of my new version okay public documents can say to two okay no method okay so what you have to do is you get to copy just pick one of the methods that you have over here and let's say this is the method that you want to uh, any methods will, will, will work perfectly okay you just need to copy the uh, the text from here right click copy it and then you just go back to this uh file and go to the method uh, remember it must be pieces one two three four five you must select the correct one then you look for method files uh dollar here and then you replace this by the one you just uh copy right page like this then you just hit the save button and then you close the window and then you start launching your software then you should be good to go right so because i'm not using that old version anymore so i can't demonstrate for you here but that should be uh that has been working many many times i mean i've been doing that over and over again for my many of my users many of my customers so uh, 
so it should work for you as well okay and uh, I guess that's uh, that's that's a very common error message that you'll be seeing over and over again uh, so uh, I hope this help you fix that problem for you and if you have any question or any comments please let me know in the comment below and uh, do not forget to subscribe to my channel for uh, I will have um, many more videos like this to fix a problem like this for you and uh, uh, I will link a couple of videos at the end of this video so that you can uh, continue watching on and to learn more about all of these uh, skills right so I'll see you in my next video bye bye